Hey BCSC families, Josh Burnett, BCSC Communications Coordinator here. Hope that you're enjoying your summer break. Hey, I wanted to get some feedback from you about some planning that I'm going to be doing for the upcoming year when it comes to content. I love to create videos, uh, take pictures, and share our school district story. One of the things that makes BCSC unique is all the different choices that we have for our students. And so I wanted to show you a video that I created during the school year and wanted to see what you think about this type of video. If you'd like to see more like it of me uh, going and interviewing students and staff members inside of classrooms uh, throughout the year. So take a watch on this video. Let me know what you think. Enjoy the rest of your summer. Today in my AP U.S. History class, uh, we're having Museum Day. I bring out all the artifacts that they've seen all year long and that have been passed around and, and that they've gotten to feel and touch that piece of history. And what they're doing is they're coming up and they're choosing one that they feel has uh, special significance because of the era that it was involved in, because of the event that it may be connected to, or because of the concept that it represents. And then they're going back to their desk and they're writing everything they know about that concept, era, event, uh, and, and really just trying to pour out as much analysis as they can of the, uh, of the causes. Uh, they're analyzing the effects, how it changes U.S. history, how it changes our thought process towards certain things. And so once they've written everything they can about that, then they pair up and with a the partner, they kind of debate their item versus their partner's items. Our students love to debate, they love to be right, and this is our opportunity to lean into that so that they get to uh, hear not only just about the thing that they wrote about in one era, but they're really kind of comparing and contrasting two different eras of history. And so we go through a few rounds of that, uh, and I actually challenge them on the third round to choose something that uh, they might have avoided because if we're trying to get stronger, we want to challenge them not just with the low-hanging fruit of the things they really feel like they know, but challenge them to really dig deep and analyze something that may be asked of them on the exam that could be an area of, of weakness for them. We want to we want to improve, we want to get stronger and, and really uh, help ourselves in that way. So I think this is really important. One, because of the, the impact that this could have on their college career. This is a class that's worth six college credits and, and we want to prepare them to, to do well on that AP exam. But I'm also trying to give them the tools that they'll need when they get into college uh, for success about how do I study, how do I take all this information and, and really kind of boil it down to the things that I need to know. Uh, and then finally, we want them to have analytical skills, not just in an academic life, but in life in general, uh, when it comes to analyzing documents and news sources and those sorts of things. So I feel like this is very supportive of a lot of different skills, both historically, academically, and in life in general. The assignment is really cool because we get to actually step back in history and we get to actually see the things that made up our history like for example um, World War II helmet or World War I helmet where we can look at this and analyze and look at them and really take a step back in history and be like this is what made history today this is why my world is the way it is right now is because of these artifacts that we get to examine and analyze and we are able to really make connections and understand how we got to the place we're at now because of these items that are sitting before us which i think is really cool i just think like the assignment really helps me like understand like the lessons that we went over like throughout the school year and it's going to help me like on like ap tests for that class because like then I'll remember and connect the different events to like different items so, like that'll help me like re recollect my mem memory. Something that's great about these assignments is that we are able to um, not just see the direct connection but that we are able to remember all these things that happen and to know that they are real and that we can remember these things for the days to come. So this course is really helpful for my life now and for the future because we are able to look back at history and analyze it and be able to learn not to make those same mistakes that we made in past history. And because you never know, the kids sitting next to you, they could be the next president. And by doing that and analyzing our history, we are able to take that to our future and apply it to our future lives and careers and be able to just understand where we came from and how we can progress from that.